Crown Princess Metamarit is seriously ill. Now husband Hakan decides to speak out about the situation, from the outside, it looks like Metamarit is feeling fine, but the truth is that she is battling a chronic illness. In 2018, the Crown Princess was diagnosed with pulmonary fibrosis, which means that scar tissue forms in and between the small alveoli. Because of this, Metamarit sometimes has to shelve her official duties. Now she is feeling worse again, which prompts Hakan to speak up. Crown Princess Metamarit is ill. That Metamarit is not going through the best of times has already been made clear in connection with our Swedish king's 50 years on the throne. The Crown Princess was invited as one of the guests of honor to the anniversary banquet, but was unable to attend. The exact words of the court read thus, the Crown Princess will not be able to make the planned visit with the royal couple and the Crown Prince to Stockholm to celebrate next weekend the Regency anniversary of Swedish King Carl Gustav. Unfortunately, since then there have been some grim news such as the extension of Metamarit's medical leave. This is why the Crown Princess was notable by her absence when Crown Prince Hakan was in Germany this weekend. Crown Prince Hakan's words about Metamarit. Unfortunately, the doctors have called her off sick. Hopefully she will be back on her feet soon. She has a chronic lung disease, the crown prince told the newspaper. He adds. Of course it affects her. But she also has good days and still knows a lot, the crown prince explains to Bild. At the moment it also seems that Metamarit will not be at Prince Christian's 18th birthday celebration in Copenhagen in two weeks, according to the royal calendar. It is pulmonary fibrosis. Pulmonary fibrosis means that scar tissue forms within and between the small alveoli, making the lungs stiff. Idiopathic pulmonary fibrosis, which is the most common type, was previously reported to have a median survival rate of 3 to 5 years. Current treatments, including lung transplantation, are likely to improve the prognosis. According to the Heart and Lung Foundation, there are people who live 10 years after diagnosis and even longer after lung transplantation.